So in your system, you can go and look at um, certificates that are already in your system that you've accepted or have already been built in, and you'll see that they'll have just what I went through. They'll have the version number of the standard that's being used. They'll have an individual serial number, the asymmetric algorithm and the hashing algorithm, the CA used to sign it. Um, it has all of that information. And then you could look at information on the certificate which will indicate what the certificate can be used for. Uh, it could be used for, you know, like I said, with an email or signing software. It will have basically permissions of how it can be used and, and what it was developed for.